It's a beautiful day to visit a museum. What's the history be behind this museum now? <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's go inside. Oh, this is nice. We're at the Malva Museum. Take a look. Right. The Malva Museum is located on Figueroa Alcorta Avenue, 3415 in Buenos Aires, Argentina. It was established on September 20, 2001 by the Eduardo Constantini Foundation. The mission of the Malba Museum is to collect, preserve, research, and promote Latin American art from the onset of the 20th century to the present. This involves educating the public about Latin American artists and the diversity of cultural and artistic holdings in the region. The museum is open every day from 12 p.m. to 8 p.m. It's closed on Tuesdays and on Wednesdays it opens until 9 p.m. The general entrance fee is 600 pesos, 300 pesos on Wednesdays and persons who are students, teachers or retired pay 300 pesos and per children under five, year, five years old can enter for free. Also persons with disabilities can enter for free. The artistic viewing that you're seeing in this video is from Rafael Barradas from Uruguay and each artistic or group of paintings stays in the museum or on this floor of the museum for six months. If you visit Buenos Aires, ensure to visit the Malva Museum.
place to get a smoothie. And he said of it is like natural. I'm gonna see. Mm. It's good. It's yogurt, honey, coconut milk, water, and uh, berries. Well, it's it's okay. <laughs> Think of it, it's weird, it's a weird taste. <laughs> Mommy, we are going to the El Ateneo, which is one of like the biggest bookstores in the world. That's what it looks like, and now we're going to enter. Expensive though, I guess because they're used a lot here. We're heading to the kiddies section. We have all the books for the little kiddos. And look again, we have CDs. Wow, these seem to be a thing. Let's see how pricey or cheap they are. Eight hundred and eighty-seven pesos. Not too bad. That would be about what? 10 US dollars or less? Yeah, yeah less than 10 US dollars. But why do they have these things in the kiddie section? A lot more CDs, CDs. Reggaeton. Oh, they don't have reggae. Looking to see if they're like a reggae song, music, the games for the kids. Let's see, this is international. I'm looking to see if I can find any reggae albums. Amy Winehouse, Hannah Montana. For the kiddos, it's colorful as it ought to be. And look at the floor, we have all the letters, very comfy and colorful. Ateneo Junior. Of course, we found what is this? A DVD, CD? What is it? It's live from Why is it so cheap? Bob Marley. Thing? That is the only we see from Jamaica here. Yeah, and it's it's cheap. Five hundred and twelve pesos. That's a one hundred and fifty-four pesos. Here's something cheaper. <laughs> <laughs> and very here strange. we have some records. Wow, these should be very expensive. Yeah. Because they're Venus. Yeah, nine thousand, eight thousand pesos, seven thousand. That would be like one hundred US dollars or less, eighty maybe. Here we have some more records. I'm not even sure how people play these things these days. Here. 
We have some others. View of the library. You did actually have a lot of books, man. Okay. And look, that's what you saw from downstairs. Nice view. Books. 